Welcome back. Now we look at how to convert this query to Java code. But before we look at that, let us take a look at our last code. From our last code, I've just added one other thing here, which is match. Match is saying that match where sum is greater than 2500. We are trying to get it where this sum that we have accumulated will add over time. Is greater than 2500 before we project we're going to match that means we are going to we are searching for result that are there's cumulative sum from what you have gotten from that previous result we are adding match now that match where that means the sum that the amount that we're going to project is greater than that let me copy this code as usual and paste it there this would have been the last stage sellers This already test code. If you can look at it from the previous code, now let me just remove the match so that every record about that come up so that you can see the diff clear difference. From here, the match starts. Match starts at the end here. Good. Look at it, bro. This driver having 2000 is because of the match. Do like that. Let's move straight forward for what we have come here to learn. This is not going to have a display, we are going to implement as we want. Have to convert this code to a Java code. Java code they provide classes for it. MongoDB have done simple collections and printing out. You know that before you have to get collection as usual that here is collection payment first. We are getting the payment collection. After that that collection we're going to perform an action on that collection object collection dot aggregate then as I earlier told you this is an a list of stages in array good then here is array list then let us first the first stage here is lookup stage we start here and ends here lookup is here user user id id that is id from the local from the payment id again id id for the users we are joining table on two primary keys here okay and we are populating it as user if you like you can do this one and your thing here to populate the whole result as we did uh, in that other code step by step but let us add another stage here aggregate dot mm -hmm, group we are trying to group it this group used to take a lot of time. You can look at from here. The group starts here. Group mm -hmm, based on this ID. We are grouping based on the ID of our group is ID. We are naming it to be ID. Here the ID of our group is ID. There's no rename for it. Mm -hmm. And in that group, after we have given the basic ID here, we can end it here. But that is, uh, we can end it here as we have done that previous lesson, but we didn't end it here. Then we have some here. Same thing concerned to this one. We would have ended this thing here, but no, we didn't do that. After grouping, we say we want to sum, and we're naming that now to be cumulative sum. And our cumulative sum here, here it was what? Let's go back. Here it was sum. Instead of cumulative sum, then sum mm -hmm, amount. Yes, cumulative sum. We have renamed it to be cumulative sum. Then we say it's an amount field that we are taking it. Mm -hmm. Accumulator again dot first the name then user dot name. We are taking first name user dot name. We have renaming it to name. We are taking it first in the group. We are taking the first value user.name same thing is here we are taking the first one we have taken the first one where is user.name mm -hmm. we are taking name but first one this one now have user.name because we are already okay look at it here project the first project we are taking name user.name here we have done projection before that then we didn't do it but this is first user that name. So this is Java code of command so many things there. 
but it's the first one user dot main now we are matching this are match is the filter then the match filter is greater than cumulative sum 50,000 from that code there yeah, that means should be 2,500 2,500 mm -hmm. project again project dot projection fields look at the projection aggregate dot project mm -hmm. projection dot fields projection dot include cumulative sum name from name age there's no need for age something else that i've copied it here steam editing you can try it on your own and see what the outcome will become thank you